He says, how would you know that Allah has accepted your dua, accepted your prayer? The answer is you don't. As simple as that. And this is why the Muslim is between two things. Between his fear of Allah Azza wa Jal, his fear that his forms of worship will be rejected and not accepted by Allah, his fear that his repentance is invalid, and between hoping in Allah's mercy and Allah's forgiveness, having positive thoughts that Allah Azza wa Jal would change his uh, uh, situation from bad to good and from evil to uh, righteous, etc. While having this balance, whatever you do, you never know that. Is this sincere? Am, am I doing this program for the sake of Allah or to be famous? Am I doing it to get rewards from Allah Azza wa Jal or to get praise from the people? I don't know. Will Allah accept it from me or not? I don't know. I do it and I pray to Allah that my deeds are sincere for His sake and I'm fearful that maybe I'll come on the Day of Judgment Allah says all of this is not valid and it's void because you did not do it for my sake. But at the same time, I would not sit back and say, Khalas, Allah Azza wa Jal is going to throw me in hell and there's no use. No, I try to change my intention. I try to make it for the sake of Allah and to help people, etc. And by this balance, inshallah, you'll be in good hands.